today because we wait what the f so i'm in some random suburb i don't know where the f i am but i am going to go to all these different thrift stores and see what i can find today i'm so excited i have missed thrifting so much like i went like two months ago and i'm I need to go. I need to go thrifting right now. So Tyler and I are visiting family at the moment and we're very far away from home. Like very, like I miss my birds so much. I'm not coping okay. But I thought that I would use this time to not only of course catch up with family but also go thrifting in a whole new area i feel like the vibe is very different like where i'm from it's very like retirement village it's giving nana whereas i feel like the thrift stores towards the city are very good like there's some real good gold in there so i'm really excited to get into this thrifting store today and more i'm going to more thrift stores i want to do like a big haul my goal is to do a big haul today like i want to be able to get some summer and spring clothing and i was scrolling on pinterest last night and i have an idea of what i'm looking for but i don't particularly have like a certain vibe that i'm going for like if i just see something i like i'm gonna grab it so i'm gonna stop yapping on and i'm gonna go thrifting i'm so excited if we were close to home i would get those couches but I won't know until I actually try it on. I also thought this dress would be super cute with like a little t-shirt underneath it. So potential dress for spring, we love that. There's so many people in here though guys, like I'm feeling overwhelmed. Is here, like I've already filled up my trolley. Oh, my God! Oh, my God. I'm so exhausted. I was in there for at least two hours. I'm not even kidding. And I didn't realize, but today they're doing like this special 50% off all clothes. So I got a lot of clothes. I need to find some lunch. I need to get some energy back into my system because I am struggling. The good thing about this little area is we are near the beach. And if you don't know, I don't live near the beach anymore and it makes me so freaking sad. So I'm gonna go grab lunch by the beach. I can't freaking wait. <laughs>
honestly the best lunch I've ever had. Like, I wish I lived in the beach so I could do this more often with myself. All right, I'm gonna try my, you can't even see, I'm gonna try my smashed avo. This looks so good, oh my God. I'm trying to cut this out and it's just not working for me. Oh my God, it's like, it's like a rock. I got some, let's try this out. Oh my God, that's so good, what the hell? They think I'm gonna give them a chip. I'm not gonna give you guys a chip. Like, you can go away, please. Oh my god. Guys, I'm, I'm literally surrounded in seagulls. Is this an attack? I scored a couple of goodies at that thrift store. I'm so excited. I was gonna go to more thrift stores, but it's honestly four o'clock in the afternoon. I'm exhausted. I'm I'm ready to pass out, honestly. Two days later. Two seconds for you guys, but it's been two days for me and I'm actually sick now. The Shelly you saw like two seconds ago, she was nice and healthy and fresh and, and now I have a cold and I'm really sad about it. Like my throat. I'm gonna be trying everything on as well as giving you guys a little haul because I really wanna show you how Hello. I would style, <laughs> what are you doing? How I would style these pieces. I actually have no idea how I would, but we're gonna have some fun with that. Without further ado, let me show you guys what I got from the thrift stores. Let's start off with the savers bag because- This is massive. So I had in mind that I wanted to buy like spring and summer clothes, but I ended up getting a lot of winter clothes as well. For example, this green cropped sweater that I literally couldn't go past. It's also got these kind of weird weird holes in the back there. I don't know what that's about. I've got no idea. This was $10.50, but they were having like a sale event thing going on where all the clothes were 50% off. So I got this for pretty much $5. Seriously? Wait, I just feel like this sweater is such a fun little like throwover sweater. Like I've literally just got leggings on with my sneakers and a little tote bag and some glasses. Like fashion baby. I just feel like this is kind of like a casual fit when you don't know what to wear and you still look really good. Plus this is so comfy and it's not itchy. So for $12.79, which actually would have been $6, I got this white, kind of a high neck long sleeve top. I feel like I have way too many long sleeve white tops and I'm not even mad about it. You can just never have too many. I didn't realize this would be super see-through, but I freaking love it. The way that this top would be perfect for a festival is giving me so much life right now. Like having like a cute little bra underneath this with some maybe like crochet pants or something, like a bucket hat. This is so much better than I expected. I love this. Ooh. Oh, I forgot about these. I'm really excited about these. I found these pajama pants. I mean, you could wear these in public, absolutely, but I instantly thought of these as pajama pants. And I've just seen the bottoms there where they're... I can fix that. I, I got these for $8, so they would have been like $4, so steal. I'm sure you guys can do the math, so I'm going to stop doing that. Anyway, I even put on my slippers so you can get the idea that I'm going to bed right now because... These are so comfy. I feel like I'm not even wearing pants, to be honest with you. Like, these are like skin. I wish you guys could see the bottoms because these are so cool. Like, they're just big wide leg flares, pretty much. They're so freaking cool. I'm so excited about this. Like, I have been wanting really cool jackets for like the longest time, but I feel like I can never find the perfect one. Like, I don't know what the perfect one is, but I go to a thrift store and like try and find it. I don't know if anyone else does that. I found this kind of bomber style jacket and it's got a hood on it and it's originally from Glasson, so I was like, can't go wrong with that. And it was only for $8.50, so $4. I don't have any other describing words other than this is so cool. Oh my God. I'm so happy about this coat or jacket or whatever the heck it is. Catch me wearing this all the time because this is so freaking cool. I'm actually speechless. I have no words, guys. I have literally no words. This is the coolest fucking thing I've ever bought. I got myself a little bag. Look how cute this is. And they had so many bags at Savers and I was like umming and ahhing about every single bag that I saw because there were so many cool options. I saw this one. Once again, it's beige, it's textured. It's from Colette. I used to love going to Colette when I was a teen. There was something nostalgic about this and I just couldn't go past it. So 
I had to get it. Okay, so I got this super thick, chunky sweater from White Fox, actually. That's a steal. I know this would have been like $60. And it's such good quality as well. Like, it's so thick. It's not itchy either. Like, this is going to keep me so cozy and so warm because it's so freaking cold. And that's why I'm sick right now. I love the color. I love that it's cropped. I love that it's thick. Okay, this sweater is so comfy. I can't deal. This is so comfy. And it's not itchy either. Like, I swear, every sweater I've got from a thrift store is so freaking itchy. But this... Is no, oh, this is not itchy. This is comfy. This is really warm. I'm sweating a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. These are like little knitted shorts that I thought would be so cute for like bedtime as well. I really like to invest in my pajamas. I really don't know why. I just thought this was such a cute little steal for eight dollars. Like these are so sweet. Why did I put that there as if this is a top? This is no. These are just so comfy. They're a lot less thick than I thought they would be. These are so comfy. They're really flattering. I really like these a lot. Now this one, I don't know if I actually liked this, but I couldn't try them on because the line to the try, try, what are they called? The change rooms, the try on place. Whoa, my brain is not working today. I couldn't try anything on in the thrift stores because the line was just that massive. I was like, no, nah, this is not gonna work. So I'm kind of on the fence about this one here. I really like open neck, like kind of quarter zip things at the moment. I'm obsessed with them. I love the look of them. It's very much my style. I really like it. So when I saw this, I thought I could get behind it because it's literally just a V cut. It looks like a quarter zip. I really liked the pattern as well. It's like a really strange bubble texture i don't have describing words today it's not gonna happen i just feel like it's the neck part that's really strange i like the texture of this this is really fun i, I don't know i really don't know maybe i'm just not wearing the right pants oh it could look cute like if i just tuck this into my bra real quick i could get behind this okay i liked the cropped version a bit more when it's cropped it's cute when it's not cropped it's giving single dad with a bachelor pad talking about quarter zip sweaters i actually found one and it was green if you don't know i love green like i'm a neutral girly but if i was to have a favorite color it's freaking green i love green it's still really soft on the inside as well so i feel like it hasn't been as worn in as i'm expecting it to be could not believe it it just it felt right i saw it and it just instantly fell into my trolley accidentally don't mind me just going on a hot girl errands run got my flared leggings on this time it really sets the tone a quarter zip sweater and flared leggings is like i'm gonna be wearing this literally every day like it's so soft whoever donated this thank you and like i love it tucked in but even like tucked out <laughs> still freaking cute i walked into the savers and i was just hit with decor items i was like holy sh like give me a chance to soak it all in first but i couldn't i found this little square thing i don't know what it is or what i would do with it but i got it for three dollars i thought that i could like have this in like a bathroom or something and put like your soap dispenser and tumbler on here with like your toothbrushes i feel like that would be cute so if you've watched my other thrifting videos you will know that i am a magnet towards sauce dipping trays i don't know why but i'm just drawn to anything that i can put sauces in excuse me i found this at Savers and I couldn't believe myself. You could probably put like little chips and stuff in there or like when you do tacos, you could do like your guacamole, your salsa and like whatever else goes in there. I'm just, I don't know, I'm an ideas gal. Anyway, that's all the decor I got. And then I went into Salvo's. If you don't know, Salvo's is like one of the big boys in Australia. I just feel like I can't go wrong in Salvo's. Every time I walk into Salvo's, I come out with something. It just, it hits right every time. So I walked into Salvo's and the first thing I saw was this waffle textured bathrobe. Now for the longest time, I've been looking for the perfect bathrobe. So when I I saw this beige waffle bathroom for nine dollars you best believe i ran to the checkout with this bad boy i can't wait to live in that okay and i got myself this super cute white linen dress i got this for eleven dollars so it's a bit steep but it's okay because it's from a brand called atmos and here once again, I got no idea what that is, but it's stunning. It's got extra bits of fabric here so you can wrap it around, do like a cute bow at the back or the front of the dress. And it's got buttons up the middle as well. And I just, I fell in love, mainly for the texture. I love anything to do with linen. Okay, let me set the scene here because this is the cutest fucking dress I've ever worn. And the fact that I got this from a thrift store, I love this. And then for $5, I got these pants that are so cool. They're striped and they're about a quarter length. So they show off a bit of ankle. I just really love pants. And I'm so excited to wear these when the weather starts getting a little bit warm and I can actually feel my throat. I'm in so much pain right now. Okay, this is a very slapped together outfit, but I love these pants so much. I cannot get over them. I did pair this originally with a white tank, but I thought the black would make more sense because of the little black stripes in the pants. These are the coolest pants. 
I own. I'm not even gonna lie. I think this is honestly my best thrifting experience yet. Like the last one was good, yes, but this one, even better. Like I love everything in this pile. There's not one thing that is a favorite of mine. I'm just obsessed with every single thing here. Anyway guys, I'm gonna go make myself a hot soup because I can't feel my throat. Thank you guys so much for sticking around and enjoying my haul this week. I really appreciate your support always. I love you all, like seriously. And I will see you guys on Sunday. So bye.